Hello everybody, this is Mr. Rob and welcome back to episode number 23 of the Detroit Lions franchise here on Madden NFL 21. Today we have reached the conclusion of the 2020 NFL season with Super Bowl 55, a first time matchup between the Cleveland Browns and the New Orleans Saints. Cleveland Browns reaching the Super Bowl for the very first time in their career while this is the second time the New Orleans Saints will make it. They will, however, be playing this game without Alvin Kamara. As you can see, he has been injured partial piece or ACL tear. He had a very good year, 926 yards on the ground. His most productive in that category, including four touchdowns in the air. So both teams take a look at the roster. Both teams, very different routes. Browns coming into this one, the 9-7, 6th seed in the AFC. They're 7th in offense this year. Tied for 3rd in points per game, however, with the Saints. But their defense was a little bit suspect. 20th defense in the league, 13th in the pass department, 28th in the run defense. On the other hand, but they do have some playmakers. Um, as you can see, Miles Garrett, Baker Mayfield's had a good year, 4,200 yards for him. They've been also led by the dominant running by duo of Nick Chubb and Kareem Hunt, who combined for 29 touchdowns on the ground. So they're not a team to sleep on lightly. But the NFC, you do have the favorites, the 14-2 New Orleans Saints, who are led, obviously, by... Their MVP quarterback this year, Drew Brees, who finally got his first ever MVP. He had 4,694 yards passing, 45 touchdowns and 13 picks. One of the all-time greats. He had the best offense and the best defense this year. Tied for third in points per game and fifth in points allowed. So you can just take a look, look at the roster on this screen. Just absolute playmakers all over the football from Michael Thomas to Cameron Jordan. Marshawn Lattimore, just players in all levels of the field. So it'll be a tough task. My pick is on the Saints, but we have to watch to see who finds out. And here we are at Tampa Bay Raymond James Stadium, home of the Buccaneers for Super Bowl 55 between the Cleveland Browns and the New Orleans Saints. If you're excited for this one, make sure you leave a like and subscribe down below, especially if you want more franchise content here on the channel. Both their teams making their way out. Saints were the designated home team, so they got their home black song. Well, the Cleveland Browns will be the road team in this one. Saints will receive the ball to start the game, and we are underway here in Tampa Bay for Super Bowl 55. Taking out the two by dynamic return man down to Harris, all the way up to the 26-yard line. Here comes the MVP with Coach of the Year Sean Payton also in his headset. Drew Brees, who we talked about his numbers earlier, absolutely phenomenal. Question is though, is this his last game? That is the rumor going around for the past two weeks. We'll see what happens though. Gotta get through this game first though. Here we go, first and 10, first play of the game. Man in motion on the right side. Drew Brees in the pocket, throws it on the sky crossing, who was the motion man. That is Emmanuel Sanders, who had 909 yards this year and eight touchdowns. Second and seven now, now in the pistol formation. Drew Brees dropping back to pass. He's got nobody open. And he's gonna be sandwiched for a sack. Sheldon Richardson gets the Credit for that one. And he had nine sacks in the regular season. Third and 18. Now Drew Brees across the middle, dropped by his receiver. That was Traquan Smith. He couldn't hold on. And now the Browns will take the field, led by Baker Mayfield. 4,200 yards, 31 touchdowns, 10 interceptions. A former number one overall pick out of Oklahoma, who has played with a chip on his shoulder his whole career, has finally made it to the big dance. They're going to come out first and 10 in the shotgun formation. And it's not going to be a handoff to the running back. Instead, Baker Mayfield is going to try to check it down to him, and he overthrows his man, looking for Kareem Hunt, who started this game in the backfield. It's third and 10 now, looking for Hunt. Does get it to him, but is not going to be enough for the first down, shy of the marker. And both teams start with punts. So not what I expect in this game. I expect this one to kind of be a high-scoring affair. But now the Saints with the second possession, first and 10, check down to Jared Cook, the veteran from South Carolina. At 808 yards receiving this year. Second and nine, Drew Brees, another short pass across the middle. This time he does find Traquan Smith. Traquan Smith did have 10 touchdowns this year, so everybody likes to look at Michael Thomas and Emmanuel Sanders, but Traquan Smith, another phenomenal player this year. Second and eight, we've got a man wide open, and this pass is going. Nice break and tackle. Jared Cook all the way down inside the 20. There is a flag down on the play. It's roughing the passer, though, so it's going to go against the defense. And specifically, Andrew Sandejo, who led the Browns in tackles this year with 100 on the dot, is your culprit. And just like that, we got now first and goal from the eight for the Saints. Come out in a heavy look. They're going to hand it off to the deep back. And that is Ty Mont or Latavius Murray into the end zone for a touchdown. 
He has been your fill-in for Alvin Kamara this year. He had six touchdowns in the regular season, doing his best to replace that production. So now, can the Browns answer? Going to start off with Baker Mayfield in the pocket, scrambling, runs out of space, and he basically runs into his own lineman before he throws the ball. Now second and ten, another pass. This one, a quick one across the middle, and that is going to pick up the first down. Nice completion. Only Baker's second of the day. Second and five. Now they're going to start handing off to the running backs. There is Nick Chubb, 10, 183 yards, 16 touchdowns on the ground. Third and two, stays in the game. you got to think this one's going to Nick Chubb. Take the snap, and it is going to Chubb. Chubb's going to pick up the first down. Tough to bring that man behind the line before Alex Anzalone makes the tackle. He did lead your Saints team with 97 tackles this year. Now third and four, though, the Browns are going to throw on this third and short, and they're going to throw across the middle successfully. That is Rashard Higgins with the first down, moving all the way to the 33-yard line. Now this first and ten, they're going to go empty. Baker Mayfield making an adjustment. He's going to throw it across the middle. It's been the hot topic for both teams. That one is complete. Down now inside for the red zone. That is Jarvis Landry. Second and three now. Baker rolls to his left, overthrows. I guess he was throwing it away, but he did have Kareem Hunt in the flat. Didn't check it down, so now the third and three are going to come out in the I formation. Andy Janovich is your fullback. They're going to hand it off into the deep back is Chubb, and he's going to power his way for a first down, do what he basically done all year. So now we got goal to go for the Browns. Saints showing pressure. Both safeties creep down into the box. Browns are going to run a play action fake, and it's not the right call. The safety gets home. That is Malcolm Jenkins into the backfield for a sack. Already his third tackle of the day. Not a good call for the Browns, given that look. So now third and goal from the nine. Baker rolls to his left this time, tries to check it down, doesn't get his man in bounds. And the Browns have to settle for a field goal. Austin Seibert on, and he will drill home at the 26-yarder. It is now 7-3, and that will be your score after one quarter here in Tampa Bay. Now the start of the second quarter. The Saints are all the way out to the 38-yard line. Drew Brees almost sacked. Hit as he threw. Good pass, though. And he starts off 8 for 10 for 112 yards. The MVP picking up where he's done all season long. Now second and two, trying to hand off to Ty Montgomery. He's been more of the receiving back out of the third down back, but does get the carry there on second down. Third and one, though. Didn't get the first really close. Saints are going to roll a bootleg, and they're going to throw it outside to Josh Hill who does have the first down. Hill only had nine catches this season, but out of those nine catches, three were touchdowns. So new set of downs now here for the Saints into Browns territory pretty deep. Now they're going to hand off to Ty Montgomery. He's going to bounce this one outside. Ty Montgomery has the first down and more all the way down to the seven-yard line. Ty Montgomery. First in goal now from the seven. Drew Brees drops back first down and pass, and that ball is incomplete. Receiver could not hold on. Make it now second and goal. They're going to try to pass for it again. Looks across the middle. Has a man in the end zone. Touchdown, Saints. That is Ty Montgomery out of the backfield for a receiving touchdown. And both backs for the Saints getting it done early. So it's now 14-3. Browns are going to start off with a handoff to Nick Chubb. That time he is met in the backfield for a short game. Makes a second and eight. He will stay in the ball game. There is movement, though. And they're going to throw a flag. It is going to be on the offense. So false start, Browns. Looks like Chubb was your culprit. He's a little upset about that one. It's now third and two. Kareem Hunt checks into the ball game. Baker Mayfield drops back. He's going to throw it across the middle, and he's got – no, he doesn't have Odell Beckham. He actually dropped that pass. Might have heard the footsteps of the defender. Third and seven now. Saints got the ball. Drew Brees across the middle has his man, Jared Cook, who's going to fight his way to the 42. And just like that, a quick little pass. Nets the Saints 19 yards. Jared Cook, five catches, 97 yards already in this game. First and 10, balls in the turf, but there is a flag on the play. They're going to throw a pass interference call on the defense, and that one's going to go against Andrew Sandejo as well. So Sandejo not having the best of games for the Browns. First and 10, Bree's going to throw. He's going to have his man. That's Emmanuel Sanders across the middle. And Sanders all the way inside the Browns' territory at the 32-yard line. Manuel Sanders, 909 yards receiving this year and eight touchdowns. His past offense, as you can see, has been explosive. Third and two, they're actually going to hand it off, though, to Ty Montgomery, who fights through another tackle before being brought down at the 15. So Ty Montgomery showing a little bit of power here early in the game. Now third and four, Browns send a blitz. And what a play by the blitzing Kevin Johnson. Completely hurdled Ty Montgomery to get the Drew Brees. 
and that will force a Will Lutz field goal from 30 outs. It is up and it is good. So it's now 17 to three Saints. So the Browns now have a chance for a little bit of a two minute warning offense. Two minute offense, I couldn't really think of what I was saying there. There's a quick pass across the middle off the rolling. Baker Mayfield gets it to second and one. They're actually now going to fake the handoff, throw it across the middle, and Baker Mayfield is picked off. That is Marcus Williams, and he's going to take it right side. Only one man who can catch him, and he misses, and he is going to find the end zone. A pick six here for the Saints. Marcus Williams with a 62-yard return, and the Saints are going to go up 24-3 to here in a huge turn of events. Baker trying not to make this one look like a blowout. He's going to scramble right side, actually take off with it, and have plenty of space before dipping out of bounds. Good awareness by the CPU quarterback to actually dip out of bounds there. So now out to the 43, about a minute and a half to go. Baker's going to look to throw across the middle. Actually, the left side, he has Odell Beckham Jr. I haven't really called his name today. He makes the catch. Be Beckham had over 1,000 yards in the regular season. Now on the goal step of the red zone, Baker Mayfield's going to throw it off the middle. There's Odell Beckham again, all the way down to the two. And the Browns, they really need a score here. 32 seconds to go. They're going to hand off to the fullback, Andy Janovich, on second and goal, and he finds his way into the end zone. Touchdown, Browns makes this one a little bit closer. And it will go into the half down 24-10. to 10. But the Browns do, however, get the ball at the end of the half, so they will get the ball. Have a chance to make this a one-score game. Baker Mayfield steps up in the pocket, finds Kareem Hunt on the check down. He powers through a defender to get to the first down marker. Now third and five, however. Four-man rush over to the left. There's Odell Beckham again getting involved in this one. He beats his man, and he has another first down. First and ten, play fake, cross the middle again. This time he's going to find Rashard Higgins, and Hollywood Higgins has another first down. So the Browns putting together a nice solid drive here to begin the third. They're going to go with another play action across the middle. And there's Odell Beckham way downfield. And Beckham's going to fight into the end zone for a Browns touchdown. And it is now a one-score game. about Beckham do the whip, do a little dance. And that makes it 24-17. So the Saints, they really got to stop this little bit of a rally here for the Browns. First and 10, a little quick pass to Cook. And he's going to fight forward for another quick gain of 21. Just a quick strike offense gets so many yards. Second and one, however, Saints are going to go play action, try to throw it across the middle or to the right side. This angle screws me up, and there's Michael Thomas. Michael Thomas had 1,200 receiving yards and 12 touchdowns in the regular season, as well as over 100 receptions. After the false start, it's now first and 15. Drew Brees tries to get rid of the pass, but Larry Ogunjobi is going to bring him down for his first sack of the game. Now third and 11, Saints looking to pass once more. And an unblocked Ogunjobi brings him down again. Two quick sacks by Larry Ogunjobi. And that'll end this Saints drive right in its tracks. But they're going to try to kick a 51-yard field goal. Will Lutz drills it from deep. And that gives the Saints another two-score lead. This is now 27 to 20, or to 17, excuse me. Two and a half to go in the third. Quick pass from Bacon Mayfield to the sideline. Nice catch by Jarvis Landry. So now new set down into Saints territory once more. Nowhere to go, however, for Kareem Hunt. There is a flag on the play. It's going to be an illegal block in the back. So he loses yards, and it's an illegal block in the back on Odell Beckham. So a horrible play there for the Browns. Sets up now first and 20. Baker Mayfield play action. Kareem into block. He's going to chuck it downfield. And that is caught. Touchdown, Browns. Taewon Taylor with the grab an amazing grab one-on-one -on -one coverage baker mayfield took his shot and it paid off what a play by taewon taylor to score that touchdown and it's now a three-point lead going to the fourth quarter so this one looked like a blowout early but the browns are starting to rally well the saints pull what the atlanta falcons did a few years ago and blow this one and there's a nice completion now inside the 25 of cleveland Empty set here, second and 10. Drew Brees right side pass is caught by Jared Cook. He's had a great game so far. Wonder if his his last game as well. Now second and four from the six. Drew Brees drops back, checks it down to his running back out of the backfield. He will not get to the first down. Good swarm defense by the Browns. Sets up third and goal. Going to come spread. Empty look. Drew Brees in the pocket. He's got nobody open. He's drifting back, running out of time, but he does throw it, and it is caught in the end zone. Touchdown, Saints. That is Emmanuel Sanders with the grab. The former Bronco getting the score here, and that puts the Saints once again 
up by 10. Baker, does he have an answer? He's going to roll right this time. And he's going to take off for it again. Baker Mayfield has got plenty of room to run. Baker Mayfield still running and finally slides down, but not until he gets to the 42 of New Orleans. Two rushes, 51 yards for Mayfield. He is your Browns' leading rusher after that play. Third and three now. Throws to the left side. Beautiful pass to Odell Beckham. He gets his two feet and down. And now the Browns are once more in the red zone. Odell Beckham, seven catches, 113 yards, and a touchdown so far in this game. Second and seven, they're going to hand up up the middle, and Nick Chubb's going to have plenty of space. He's not going to pick up the first, but it does set up a short third and one try. They are going to pass. They're not going to give it to the running backs. Baker's going to roll right side. He might be able to get to this one. He's going to throw it deep, though, and just misses Austin Hooper, who was getting open. So they will take the field goal here. Austin Seibert on again, and he's going to drill it home. So they will get it to a one-score game. It is now 34-27. Four minutes to go in this one, however. Running out of time. Drew Brees is going to pass on first down. That's a very interesting call. And he is brought down way in the backfield. So not working out for the Saints. You would think they'd be running some clock here. Now it's third and 14, a minute left. They're going to try to pass again. Have a crossing Jared Cook. That's not Jared Cook. That's Emmanuel Sanders across the middle. Will not get the first down. So the Browns will have another chance. Another two-minute drive here for Baker Mayfield. Can he get the Browns back in this one? That pass to Hooper is not going to get it done. However, that one is incomplete. Now second and 10. Baker back to pass once more. Checks it down left side. That's Cunt. He will get out of the backfield. But it is now third and six. Got to make something happen here. Across the middle. He has Odell Beckham wide open in the second level out past the 50. So that will move the chains. Clock is running, though. They're going to go no huddle. Minute 30 to go. Baker Mayfield looks right side. And Baker is picked off. That is a huge interception as Gardner Johnson is the pick. Baker tried to look to the flat. It took a little too long to get it out there to Rashard Higgins, and he was made to pay. Gardner Johnson jumps the routes, and now the Browns need a stop. A first down does end it. What a play by Chauncey. First and ten. Now the Saints will start running the football. They're going to give it to Latavius Murray. They're going to not call a time. They're actually going to call a timeout. Second and five now. Give it to Murray again. He doesn't get it. So another timeout. Cleveland, they need a stop right here, though. Third and three. Man in motion. They're going to fake the pitch. Doesn't fool this defense. However, Ty Montgomery is not going to get there. So the Browns will get the ball back one more time. They have no more timeouts, though. Thomas Morstead back deep to punt. He's going to get this one. It's looking pretty good. And it's looking amazing all the way down to the two. So the Browns got to go 98 yards with no timeouts. They're going to start off with a run. I guess try to get out of your own end zone, but very interesting call. David Ochoke is going to be hurt. You have to wonder if he's actually really hurt. Second and eight now. Baker Mayfield still in the shadow of his end zone. They're going to throw it this time. They're going to throw it to the left side to Austin Hooper, who doesn't get out of bounds. So you're just wasting more clock. 35 seconds to go. Still 90 yards. You have to score a touchdown here. Third and two. Baker throws a right side, and he is intercepted. Marshawn Lattimore with the pick, and that will seal this Super Bowl. Your New Orleans Saints are your 2020 NFL World Champions. They win Super Bowl 55, and they win Super Bowl title number two. The New Orleans Saints are your victors. A swarm at midfield. They were just the by far the best team this year. Went 14-2 in the regular season. March their way to the championship behind Drew Brees, Sean Payton, and got it done. Baker Mayfield, though, had three picks. You know, not good down the stretch, but you have to think this Brown squad. Give them a lot of credit for even getting here in the first place. So hopefully they will be back, especially in, you know, the young career of Kevin Stefanski. Player of the game is Marcus Williams. He does get Super Bowl MVP thanks to that pick six. And both teams celebrate. It's normal the Saints squad. Still has a lot of questions, though. Have we seen the last game of Drew Brees, Jared Cook, Emmanuel Sanders, a couple of players, a couple of veterans, as Drew Brees not only wins a Super Bowl for the second time, but he gets his first ever MVP. It'll be interesting to see what happens with this squad in the offseason, but the offseason is still far away. Give these guys a chance to celebrate. They played phenomenal all year long. Take a look at the stats. Jared Cook, Odell Beckham Jr., a couple guys had very good games. Overall, pretty solid game, but you can just tell the Saints were just one step ahead of the Browns every sense of the way. Browns did make it interesting in the third quarter, but was not enough as the Saints picked off Baker Mayfield three times. 
But that will do it for the end of season one. It's been a long journey, but it is now finally over as we look towards the off season. And we have plenty of questions, free agency, who's our coach, who are we gonna draft? We have the number 10 overall pick. You'll find the answers to the free agency questions this Friday at around 9 p.m. Eastern time will be your free agency off-season live stream. We'll do separate off-seasons for the free agency and the draft, so that draft stream will probably be the next week. But this Friday at 9 p.m., actually that means tomorrow, is your free agency off-season live stream. It's on that Twitch channel you see on your screen. But thank you guys so much for watching. I'm excited to get into season number two and so we can take this Detroit Lions team. This is Mr. Rob. And I'll see you in the next one.